What is this place? Apparently Steve leaves his truck here. He said it's the only place he can get to on time. <laughs> He'd better be. That's his truck. Steve! Steve! I'll set up. Oh, great. Now they're advertising it. So what? Listen to this. South Australian coal chain in running for biggest export order ever. In an industry first, the meeting will commence with suggestions on how to win the monster export order presented by grassroots members of the coal chain, Chris Danson, Sally Myers and Steve Pate. Grassroots? Is that what we are? Or dead meat, more likely. Relax. It's a management gimmick. They're just trying to make everyone feel involved. Chris, it's just got to sound good. Well, we still have to stand up there and make sense. My mates voted me in. We've got to deliver. Where the hell is that? Hi there. What's all this? We're going to be tied up all weekend, Sonny. I don't think so. Within a tick. Right. Any new ideas since last week? I still think advertising's a go. We've got some of the best produce in the world and exports are on the up. Let's promote ourselves. Yeah, but we're supposed to be giving them feedback from the ground up. Our personal experience. What if we just knew for sure we'll win the order? I didn't know you were psychic, Steve. Coffee? Look, can we keep our minds on the job? Nah, I'm serious. What if we knew for sure that we'll win the order? One complimentary consultation. Past, present, future, instant analysis. Gee, with that job description, our troubles are over. <laughs> Consultant, Joe Cool. I got a feeling she's pretty strict about time. Look, I don't know what your game is, Steve, but... Couldn't miss me fishing now, could I? What have you done, Steve? Now, yeah, relax, mate. It's a freebie. It's guaranteed. Where'd you get it? Uh, that's confidential. I did someone a favour once. How long have you had it? Oh, a couple of years. What? And you've never used it? Well, I didn't want to risk... I mean, waste it. Oh, great. Hi, Steve. Joe Cool. Call me Joe. Yes. Uh, right. Uh, I'm uh, Steve. No. Uh, this is Sally. Uh, she's an exporter. Hello. And this is Chris. He's a sugar plum fair farmer. Stone fruits. I've got 30 minutes. What's the problem? Uh, we, uh, well, uh, we've got this uh, mega export order coming up. Uh, it's in six months. Uh, it's for some supermarket chain in Asia. And uh, we want to know, do we win it? Who's we? Yeah, South Australia. So, you want a projection. And we're dealing with the cold chain? Right. The cold chain, South Australia. Now for visuals. Start links okay. Here we go. That's your share of the Asian market. They're your competitors behind, and that must be the export order you're after. Okay, let's move forward six months. We didn't get it. How can you prove that? It's what the data predicts based on present behaviour patterns. Behaviour patterns? <sighs> what do we do now? I only deal with facts, or projections based on facts. This contains every detail of every transaction on your cold chain. I guess your answers are in here, somewhere. So, everything's loaded in that computer? It's not a computer. Whatever. Everything's in there. Every single detail. All right. Exactly one month ago, my son David picked some plums for export. 
first for the season. I'd really like to know who ate them. It may be possible. Uh, Joe, while you're about it, um, I have a cousin in Port Lincoln, exports tuna. Any chance we can see what happened to his last catch? Sally. It's your time. His name? Nick Palanta. And Chris, your surname? Danson. I was wearing my check shirt. <laughs>